Joining us now is research geneticist Angela Davis with the U.S. Department of Agriculture. Angela, another important component of organic production is the use of mulches as well. And you have a nice demonstration here. Can you tell us a little bit about it? Certainly. Um, one of the main concerns about organic production is weed control. And so we did this demonstration plot to show the benefits and the disadvantages of various different mulches. The main benefit of mulch, of course, is weed suppression, mm -hmm. and uh, it slows down wind and water erosion. One of the disadvantages is it either, as in the black plastic, heats up the soil maybe too much in the summer, and you have the, the disposal problem with right. the plastic, or as in the, um, the rye mulch, which we have here, it, ha it cools down the soil, so okay. it could slow down your seed germination. And oh, early in the season. Yeah. Okay. Um, in the bare pl uh, plots, you had mentioned that we sometimes see some soil loss. Yes, as well. and if you, if you look carefully, the bare ground is much lower than the, than the others because over the, the three weeks that we've had these, we've already lost that much of the soil probably mainly to the rain since we've had so much rain this so year. So much rain. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, another benefit of the straw mulch is that they're organic. Um, we, can we go ahead and work those into the soil when we're finished using them? Certainly. And um, it'll increase your organic matter in the soil and over several years it'll, it'll help the soil. Help build it up. Mm -hmm. Would you give a general recommendation of one type versus the other or is it really more situational? It is situational. If you're going to plant early in the season and you need to increase your soil temperature, the black plastic is mm -hmm. perfect. Um, later in the season, when you want to cool the, the ground down, right. the um, organic mulch is much better. Also, the organic mulch could be spread out across the entire rows, uh, whereas the black plastic, that'd be difficult to do. So you wouldn't have the erosion in, in the middle. Oh, in the going. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, now, this does hold soil moisture. Mm -hmm. So if you have a wet year, that might not be something that you're really interested in doing. So it's a, it's a situational based thing. Now these you can spread, you can take it off if you need and to. Spread it thinner if, it, if it, mm -hmm. the soil needs to dry out a little bit. Mm -hmm. Now one thing you had mentioned, this is a demonstration for growers and another aspect you were looking at is how clean the crops stay. Yes, um, this is very interesting. A lot of these a lot of people who are into organic production want to market their crops as uh, an in uh, to restaurants or at the farmers markets. Mm -hmm. Well, then they have to clean the crop themselves. The benefit of the mulch is when the the overhead irrigation or the rain hits the ground, it protects the leaves from getting dirt on them. And if you go and you check the leaves, especially the the larger leaved plants like the basil, those will be much dirtier. Uh, they're covered with with um, little soil particulate matter okay. and these are much cleaner. And that just helps uh, produce a more marketable crop for mm -hmm. our growers. Well wonderful, thank you for walking us through your demonstration here. Thank you Kim.